what's going on guys uh today it is about 7 40 in the morning and we are about to go pick up something for the escape that i've wanted ever since i got the escape um but it's just been a little bit too expensive and i finally found it on a good deal so uh today we're going to drive up towards uh baltimore and pick this up so uh yeah let's go out to the car start it up and get on the road <laughs> those cold starts all right so we had just stopped at 7-eleven um, I needed a little bit of uh, a fuel and I got a, uh, a NOS and an amp they got a good deal going on for two for three so now that I have that I have a little bit of a uh, fuel to get on the road it's about an hour and a half drive up to uh, Baltimore where I'm eating them so it's gonna be a little it's gonna be a quite a drive but I definitely think the deal is worth it. Um, I had to clear out the back. Maybe that gives you a hint on anything. I don't know. But um, I might do some cinematic shots on the way up. So I will see y'all when we get there. I just got to the uh, location I'm meeting up with a guy with um, to pick up the next mod. Uh, <laughs> 94 miles and an average of 63 miles an hour. That was a long drive. And now I gotta drive it back to get home before one o'clock and it is, I think, 9.30-ish. So um, right now we're just waiting for the guy to show up. Um, I'm a little bit early, so, I mean, great. Um, and then I just gotta, when he gets here, I gotta make sure it fits in the back of this car, and that's about it. That's all I can do. So, uh, I'll update you guys when he gets here. Thanks. All right, well, guys, we have <laughs> we have what I came here to buy. All I can say is this thing is going to be so awesome and so badass when I get this thing on. <sighs> I, I'm uh, yeah screw it I'm gonna show you guys like I got a brand new brush guard okay maybe not br it's not brand new it's, it was used but dude this thing is so sturdy and it comes with four pods shackles and all of the mounting hardware and it even comes with um, hijack uh, mounts so I'm pretty stoked this thing is gonna be epic it's so much better than um, my rinky dink bull bar right now show you guys this. So this is, this is what I have now. And this should not be done. So this one, it mounts at the same points as this, but then it also goes under the hood on both sides and mounts the frame inside of here. So this thing is going to be rock solid and <laughs> so epic. Like, this thing, I guarantee if I got, if I hit something in front, it's, it's, car's fine. Car is definitely fine. Like, like this is some solid stuff. So, <laughs> I'm super excited to get this on. Um, it, it definitely needs a coat of paint. So, I'm going to sand it down at some point in the next week or two. And, uh, or not sand the whole thing down, but sand down the rust spots and try to repaint them. Um, this thing's not beautiful. But it'll get the job done and it's a lot better than what I have now. And I got it for such a bargain. So we're gonna have more light bars or light pods, shackles, and now a guard that'll definitely defend the front of my car. So uh, that's what we came here to buy. That's what I just bought. And <laughs> if anybody wants a black horse bull bar in the Northern Virginia area or West Virginia area in Morgantown, let me know. I'll sell it to you for dirt cheap. Just let me know, because this this is gonna be my new baby here. 
So anybody got a, if it's first and second gen escapes for the black horse, so whenever you want, or if you have a first or second gen escape, that will fit on your car. Um, I'm gonna be posting that in a few group pages and everything here soon. So if you're in any of my Facebook groups for escapes, there you go, I'm gonna post that. And if you're in the Arlington or Northern Virginia area or Northern West Virginia area, let me know um, and y'all can buy it from me. I honestly don't care. This thing is my new baby. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. You guys just don't even understand. This, okay, hold on, let me explain this. This is what I wanted for my escape before I did anything. I got the black horse because I was on a super good deal. I got it actually a year ago, probably for Christmas. Um, there were some good sales. I had a few gift cards and everything. I was like, all right, why not? Because this, I'm pretty sure runs like 400 and some bucks, brand new. And that was only like 180 to two, no, no, that was about 200, I think. So this, definitely better quality, but that will definitely protect the front of your car a little bit. Like if you're going off-road and it has the skid plate on it, um, that's always nice. So let, let me stop talking because I got to be back at work at one o'clock and I got an hour and a half drive, hour 40 minutes. So um, I got to get going. And it is, let's see. 946 so I better hit the road um, I appreciate y'all watching and um, I'm not really sure when this video is going to go up but I will try to get it up as quick as possible thank y'all for watching and I might finish it off later but peace